everyone, this is Travis with Diesel Laptops, and today we're going to show you how to code your Yanmar injector using the Texa Off Highway software. As you can see here, there's several different modules to the software, but the one we'll be using today will be the Off Highway. So we're going to start by clicking that, and then this one's actually in a Takahuchi excavator, so we're going to go through the construction vehicles option, choose our manufacturer, and choose the TB series. The next step will be choosing our engine type, which in this case is Yanmar. And then we'll start here and go ahead and get ourselves connected. You will need the external power whenever you're connected to these Yanmar engines. And we'll hit confirm and it'll take it just a few seconds here to actually get us connected. Once connected, I'm going to walk through the software a little bit and just kind of show you guys some functionality before we get started here. Okay, so if you did have any fault codes that show up here, and the next tab we want to take a look at over here is going to be, let's start with ECU info. So you get a little bit of information on the engine here, some part numbers. And then we'll go back to parameters. And we'll let you look at this. This is just going to be your live data on the engine. It does populate as you scroll down the list, but I'm going to work my way through here fairly quickly. Just give you guys a glimpse of what this looks like. stop a few times and let it populate for you and these values will change live if the engine is running All right. and we'll get down here towards the bottom to our different statuses okay now that we've looked at that there is this neat little dashboard feature kind of helpful gives you a pictorial representation of that system and kind of how it works um, but let's go into activations which will be all of your tests we'll just take a quick look and then we want to get into the settings tab now this is where we'll actually come in here and do our injector coding so we'll click start we'll confirm again and we'll have to enter today's date and confirm one more time here one more all right, now it's going to find the current injector codes in there. And what we're going to do is we're just going to take number two and put in number one for today since we didn't actually replace these injectors. But we'll go ahead and enter these. I'm just going to, I can use my keyboard here. Let's backspace. So I don't necessarily have to use the keyboard here on the tool. We'll enter that. A-A-S-Y-D. We'll hit confirm. Let's make sure that matches. All right. Confirm that. And we'll have to cut the key to stop. So this is where you will need that external power. We'll hit confirm again. And we'll have to wait two minutes here for this to reprogram itself in there. We're not going to wait the entire two minutes. We're just going to fast forward through. And we just want to go back into the injector coding option and show you here that it did change. So we'll confirm on through and let this load up. And as you can see now, injector number one actually matches number two. So it's as simple as that to code your injectors on your Yanmar using this tool. 